Okay. Can I see the video, please? Absolutely, Your Honor. <laughs> Your Honor, when the video plays, if you'll pay attention to the top center part of the screen, you could just see my car in the edge of the frame. There's her car. You can see the impact to mm -hmm. my car. Headlights and the license plate moves as she pulls in. She was actually reversing up an active lane in the, uh, in the street. She's reverse, reversing against traffic. She probably didn't see us because her Shh. car was full of trash. Just a second. There Let's she is, it. grabbing my arm as Let's I'm telling her I'm going to call the cops. Take a picture of her face. She's flipping out because I think she's going to bounce. And she's waddling back to her car. Listen to me. I don't need your no assistance problem, Sorry. in looking at a video. I'm just trying to keep my distance at this point, Your Honor. Did you hear what I said? Yes, ma'am. OK, let's play it again. Watch it carefully, Ms. Griefall. See his car move? Did you see his car move? Yes, you want to watch it again? Okay. Yes. So you hit his car. Panny from this video. Do you, so you hit his car. No, I did not hit his car. Okay, let's watch it again. Let's watch it again. Okay. I want you to walk right up there. Right. Walk, walk right up. So you, I mean, I can see oh, it from okay. here. I can see it. I can see Younger it. Younger than you are. I can well, see it I here. could see that you hit his car I unless some angel went and moved his car. Okay. See okay. his car yes, move? I see that. Yes, I do. Good. Very good. Now you can go back. And I see an estimate for the damage to the car, please. Absolutely, Your Honor. Photographs first. Here, sir. Photograph. Photographs. Photographs. But the way that the damage was done, there's no way I could have done that damage because I backed up straight back. No, His that's damage a, is done on I, the side I, of the listen, car. Listen to me carefully. I saw the way you hit him. You hit him on the bumper. Correct. That's all I did was hit him on the He's in the yeah, His dent is on the left side of the car. Just a second. Did you hear what I said? Yes, ma'am. I'm not stupid. No, I know. You hit him. On his bumper. Correct. Ma'am, she actually hit me on the passenger, or excuse me, on the driver's side fender. The impact from her right rear bumper left two marks in the side of the car that are exactly the same color and the same positioning on her car. I have better photos on my phone if they're hard I'd to like see. I'd like to see them. Surely. Would you play that for me again, please? You can actually still see both my headlights. Okay, so what you're telling me is you can see both your headlights at the time of the impact, Correct. which means she hit you she hit on, the on the side. side. I'll look with that in mind. Absolutely, ma'am. I see what you mean. You I got me? it. Yep. Yeah. I got it. It's pretty obvious, Your Honor. She I got the car. it. Okay. What kind of car is this? It's a Mazda Miata. It's uh, my girlfriend's first car. I bought it for her. We moved from the East Coast. She's from the five TMI. Barrels. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> What's the matter? Oh, TMI. It's going to cost him $4,200 to fix his car. That you're going to pay for no insurance? I had insurance, yes. Did you use your insurance? Uh, my insurance was liability only, ma'am. Okay. Uh, ma now the... we're going to deal with. Go ahead. Now I'm we're going. Now we're going to deal with your counterclaim. Yes. I read your answer, and in your answer, you said I did not hit his car and therefore was leaving to go into the store to do my shopping. Well, you did hit his car, and therefore, by leaving the scene of an accident, depending upon the cost of the repair, it could either be a misdemeanor or a felony, right? Correct. And I believe that the victim of that either misdemeanor or felony has a right to hold you until the police arrive. Do you understand? Yes, I do. Great. Not physically, they don't. Yes, they do. Your Honor, I oh, just a second. I oh, just a second. Yes, they do. Let us assume. Who is this person? This is my boyfriend. This is your boyfriend. Let's put your hand down. I didn't ask Sorry. you anything. Sorry. Let's assume you're walking with your boyfriend, and some kid comes up from behind and grabs the necklace that you're wearing and starts to run. And your boyfriend grabs the kid by the neck, and while he's holding the kid, you call. 911 and say, I was just robbed. My boyfriend is holding the person who just robbed me. You think he has a right to do that? Yes. Yes, of course. Because he witnessed a crime being committed. Correct. Right? And the perpetrator of that crime was fleeing. Right. You were fleeing the scene of an accident that you caused. The victim of that crime, the owner of the car, has a right to hold you until the police arrive so that you don't disappear. Got it? Got it. Your counterclaims dismissed. Judgment for the plaintiff in the amount of $4,200.